Happy Wednesday. So this video is all about the mysteries and perspectives on time. Or maybe this kind of time. What is time anyway? Well, my name is Philosophical and in this video I'm just going to throw out and try and spark some ideas and conversations about time. This mysterious concept of time. And uh, so just to begin, I like to think of time as the fourth dimension. So the we have uh, length, width, and then depth as the third dimension. So that's like a cube. But then in order for the cube to, to move, you need a fourth dimension of time. So then the cube can move within time. And uh, so this concept of time also in society a lot of people say that time is speeding up like the there's a quickening happening and um, that events are happening faster and faster but for me it kind of seems like time is slowing down um, or maybe that's just because I talk so slowly <laughs> um, but uh, but it seems to me that time is almost slowing down because I feel like I'm having more experiences in a shorter period of time. And uh, I'm really excited because next week I'm gonna be going to the Burning Man Festival. Um, if you haven't heard of that, it's this incredible festival in the desert where about 50,000 people all are living in a temporary civilization in the middle of the desert, creating huge art displays and just a totally co-creative uh, society for one week in the desert and um, while you're there almost no one is keeping track of time I mean there's like playa time is what they call it and time just seems to be like a lot more malleable there um, but it seems to me that perhaps if you bring more awareness into the present moment then time seems to slow down because more you're like picking up more stimuli than you normally would than you would otherwise and when I had my near-death experience when I was hit by the car I I like when I regained consciousness, it seemed like time had like super slowed down. Like everything was just like, Wah. and it, I think it was because I got like this burst of adrenaline, which allowed me to have like more hyper awareness. Maybe it was like a, a fight or flight kind of evolutionary survival strategy. Um, but it was like, I was like hyper aware of everything and a lot of people say this happens too when when you're in like a fight or flight mode you're you're hyper aware so like you can I don't know save someone from falling off a cliff if you need to um, so I'm curious what your thoughts are if you feel like time is speeding up if maybe you think if you tune into like the 2012 theories some people think we're reaching like a singularity of time in 2012 where or in December of 2012 where somehow at that moment like all of time will become available and we can like move into the past or the future and I was just chatting with my friend and we were saying how maybe that's because information is like much more readily available in the collective consciousness and somehow we're like building up like this uh, consciousness bank that we can all tap into or something so those are just some crazy thoughts I, I want to read this quote from one of my favorite authors Charles Eisenstein I'm gonna post a link to this chapter of his book called The Ascent of Humanity which I super highly recommend it's an amazing book I'm also gonna put this comfy uh, massager on my head because this helps me think better helps me slow down time maybe um, so anywho here's the quote keeping time the ultimate and perhaps most significant conversion of reality into numbers is the measurement of time clocks due to time 
what name and number do to the material world. They reduce it, make it finite. And what is time but life itself? Time is experience, process, the flow of being. By measuring time, by converting it into numbers, we rob it of its, of its infinitude and uniqueness in precisely the same way that nouns and numbers reduce the physical world. Time measurement turns a succession of unique moments into just so many seconds, minutes, and hours and denies the particularity of each person's subjective experience of them. So that that excerpt just brings up a lot and I feel like so many people get stuck in these routines where they just see like time as money and they're working like their register job and it's just like the song which is like time keeps on slipping 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 into the future and it's just like time is just like this burden that's like slipping by and we it's not really enjoyable per se um so i would love for you to just share your thoughts on time if you'd like to post a comment post a video response or i'm going to post this video on facebook if you want to post any related videos i love sharing related videos on certain topics um so do you think time is speeding up who the heck knows I don't know. She doesn't know. Happy Tuesday. It's actually Wednesday. It's always now. <laughs>